showing all the right stuff, including courage. Alexander Depati has a huge lead on Tony Revit and Christopher Kalick after the first of six dives in the final round. Remembering the top two go to Sydney. This is Alex Depati, who turned 15 in June. And since winning gold at the 98 Commonwealth Games, he's grown six inches and put on 30 pounds. That was a fantastic dive. His mom, Christian, is liking it. Same with his coach, Michelle LaRouche. Alex has grown a lot, but he's gotten strength and he's working on his speed. Just doing the back two and a half somersaults tuck, we'll be able to see the height he gets off the tower. Right there, a strong jump, getting in a compact tuck to complete the three and a half rotations. Alex is going to be pleased with this dive. Remember, the perfect score in diving is a 10. And if you were giving scores to mom, she'd get a 10 right there for that cheer. But the best Alex can do is one nine, two eights and a halves, and four eights for a total of 81.18 on the dive. That is a good total. And after two of six dives, Alex ups his lead to 45 over the second place diver. But Tony Revit now leads Kalik by five points in the battle for that all important second position. Consider good. Alex Depati, the world junior champion in. First three and a half somersaults tuck, the dive we've just seen Tony complete. Not a bad dive by Alex. He's going to have to improve it at the Olympics. His coach, Michelle LaRouche, knows that. He has the strength now on, and the height to get off the tower and do the dive. Alex disappointed with it. The entry is the only thing he could really improve on. Right here is getting a strong jump and getting into the tuck, completing the three and a half rotations, but bringing up a splash from his shoulders on the water. Not sure if Alex was unhappy with his dive. Four over Kalik, a bit of a slip there, but Christopher has opened up a 22-point lead on Tony Revit for second place. Points since the beginning, Alexander Depati. Alexander is one dive away from realizing his dream. Going to the Olympics. That was a great dive, a good dive, the same as Tony and Chris's. The back one and a half somersaults with three and a half twists. He did it, he just needed to land on the water. There's his mother, she's quite happy, relieved. The marks for Depati, five eights, one eight and a half, one seven and a half. He finishes a competition at 1,043 points. 41 points up on his camo teammate, Christopher Kalak. And here's a great moment, what a great sight. A big hug from Alex for his Sydney teammate, Christopher Kalek. Here's Terry. Olympic Games. Christopher Kalek, Alexander. Coach, but let me bring in the big guy here. He's all of 15, folks. Alexandre Depati, you're going off to the Olympic Games. You're a Commonwealth Games champion. What does it mean to go to Sydney? Uh, it's, a, it's a dream come true. I mean, it's it's all I ever, it's, it's all I wanted to do. And, and it's a plus to do with my teammate. So I'm Wait. very proud of him. Wait, Michelle, come here. You're not going to get away that easily. What do you think of your students? Well, it couldn't be better. I mean, I'm very happy, and having both athletes on the Olympic team, it's just a, it's, it's just a dream come true. It's great. Congratulations to Alexander Depati, Christopher Kalik. They're off to the Olympics, representing Canada in the big board, the platform. And Terry, the big man on the big board, was indeed Alexandre Depati, 41 points clear of his camo teammate, Christopher 